but the atmosphere around this, the awards ceremony, the media day, the players deserve all this attention. I'm just glad that they're getting it. Yeah. What's it like for you to come to your first Arena Bowl? I know you have an interesting relationship too with Philadelphia Souls head coach as well, but what's it going to be like going against him in your first bowl? Oh, you're playing against, you know, brothers, really. I mean, guys that I've known for a long time, one their head coach I've coached before. So it's an interesting dynamic that way, but when the coin toss goes up and the first kick is, is in the air, it, all that goes to the side. Uh, we're here to try to win a game, and, and that's our focus. Do you just kind of put those regular, gaze, regular season games behind you at this point now? You guys fell to them, but now that you're in the Arena Bowl, I mean, what's that like for you? Well, it's a one-game series. I mean, that's what it is. We're in the championship game. No matter how you get there, you're there, and, and you have to understand that that game has special significance, the, the ones during the, the course of the year, just stepping stones to get where you're at right now. So we don't really give any credence to what has happened between the two teams during the season. We're anxious to get this one going and see how we uh, match up in the championship. I know you weren't coaching here last year, but have you had time to reflect on just the amazing turnaround that this franchise had from last year and to you know, being in the Arena Bowl this year? Well, you know, I, I keep hearing all of the things about how, how we've made a dynamic turnaround and all those things like that. I'm really focused week to week, game to game. But when I look back on it and see, you know, players that have been here last year, a guy like Kendrick Ings that, that has gone on a team that, that only won two games last year, and now he's getting into a championship game, that's what I'm the most proud of, giving those individuals an opportunity to, to perform on the biggest stage. So, you know, yes, we've come a long way, and that, that's a great thing. But I think the fans of, of Tampa have deserved that, and, and it's been a long time coming. And so hopefully we can take the next step that we have to tomorrow night and bring a championship back to them. I mean, what do you think was the biggest reason for the tournament? It's players. I mean, when, when you look at what you got on the field, it always comes down to players. Coaches do a great job of orchestrating. I think we, as a coaching staff, we did a nice job of putting the guys in the right positions. But having the right chemistry, having the right players, I think it's been a big thing for us this season. And we're just so you know anxious to get into this next game, but grateful for the stick to that our players have had all season long. We've been a very resilient bunch. Feel good about the, the practices you guys had leading up to, to tomorrow night's game? We've had some of the best practices we, we've had all season long, you know, and you're going to want that. You're going to need the, your players to be keyed up, but at the same time, business-like on what they have to do. So the days we've had in our arena have been big for us to be in the preparation, but we also know that you know it's a one-game shot, so we have to be at our best tomorrow night when it counts, uh, but knowing that the preparation has been on time and on point has been special for us this week.